people of God, the Lord says he heard your petitions and he knows that your new assignment, he knows that your new job, he knows that your new position, he knows that your elevated place, your position of prominence looks absolutely overwhelming to you to a point to where you much rather do something else because you didn't realize that what God was calling you to do was going to be so hard. You didn't realize that what God was calling you to do was going to look so big, so intimidating, so frightening, right? But the Lord says that in spite of this, he has graced you for this. God says, listen to him. This is exactly what he has been preparing you for when you were in your wilderness place. This is why he shaped and molded you and disciplined you and rebuked you in your isolated place with him. God says that you have been thoroughly trained and you are now ready to partake in this mandate that he has placed on your life, says the Lord. And God says, I will send divine helpers just as I did my son Moses to help my people, to help my sons and daughters carry the burden of this assignment that he has given you. This assignment that you are currently facing, people of God. The Lord says these encounters, these divine helpers are going to help you get the job done. These divine connections will be seasoned and they will be able to help you fulfill what he has called you to do in this hour of your life, says the Lord. God says, yes. Your mandate is heavy, but you have it. Listen, because he saw that he could trust you with it. The Lord says, you will not stumble and you will not fall, beloved. God says that he has graced you and appointed you to complete this work. And the forces from the kingdom of darkness will not be able to stop what he has ordained for you to do, says the Lord.